Hello everyone and happy new moon in Gemini for July 13th. So I did a toss for the energies of this new moon and then I'm going to pull a card for each individual sign just to see what specific messages and advice comes through. Anyway, for the full, not full moon, new moon in Gemini, what we're seeing here for the energies of the day, this is for everyone. Um, I am seeing that relationships, um, relations to all in general, may be a little bit tense or eh, a little like terse. Uh, try to be extra considerate. That energy is around. It's going to be very hard to try to create balance today in what you are pursuing, okay? Because you may be pursuing whatever you're pursuing. It's going to be difficult to create some balance, especially maybe in the morning hours. Um, a little bit of nerves are on edge and it can cause some peaceful situations to be shook up a little bit, okay? Now pay attention to your dreams or maybe that you woke up with a dream. It may be still in your head. It's hard to wake up or even focus, okay? Because that could be there, but pay attention to your dreams. Even not just the dreams that you dreamed that, that you dreamt um, overnight. It's also pursuing your dreams as well. The beautiful thing I hear here, see here is there's a focus on intellectual abilities. They're very, very sharp, okay? Very alert, very clever. Um, there are some solutions that can come like in a flash, okay? If you're dealing with maybe social media, technology, um, your understanding of it is going to be really great. Um, there is a lot of progressive energy, innovative work, you know, so that's really connected there um, nicely. Try to release any old habits that you have. Um, try to refresh your thinking, okay? Because a lot of mental energy here, too. It's like this, this lunatation definitely is about power of the mind, um, local connections that you have, too. Um, there could be some travel eventually, too, coming up. You know, brainstorming some options. You get a lot of mental energy here. Very good. And apply any of those um, brilliant uh, brainstorming ideas as well. But people around you could be a little bit maybe fidgety in, in their actions, maybe even during their conversations. You know, I see a little bit of edgy energy too. Um, focus, do a lot of things on love. It is on the side here, okay? Keep following your dreams. Work, projects, very progressive, a lot of mental energy. Some of you are really gonna be in some transitional stage too as well. And this is like going into your power. This could be connect to work. And this is also really climbing a progressive energy into a lot of uh, thought that you put into work in that. Okay, so that's what the energy showed. And now we're going to pull a card for each sign. We start with Gemini. It's their moon. Okay, so Gemini, you have innocence. So today is important to create... Um, a easygoing flow towards things you know it's almost like childlike too okay so this is the energy that um the advice card that came through so just go with the flow in a way um think back sometimes when we have solutions to create um or we need to problem solve some things I'm telling you, kids can just say something that is like, wow. It's like, they should be just teaching adults. So that is another way we can look at innocence. So that's the card that came up for you guys. And Cancer, surrender, okay? Anything that's out of your control, things that, been, um, that you've been maybe worried about, whatever it is, um, this could be sometimes when I see this, it could be connected to addictions or uh, obsessive behaviors, anything like that. Or what you don't feel you have control of, any situation, is just surrender. Go with the flow. Give it to the universe. So that's a special message for you guys. And we got Leo. Okay, Leo centering, okay? So trying to stay grounded, centering. Pay attention to your circle. Pay attention to... Um, things that are uh, circling around you, your surroundings and that, and trying to center things and creating some balance, okay? Virgo. 
healing. This is a great time for healing now. Old wounds starting off fresh. There are some healing energies coming through. You may be dealing with, uh, maybe you're helping out and healing um, others or doing some healing work too. So that is the special message that came out for you guys. Libra. Dreams. Okay, so that came through here too. Pay attention to your dreams. Okay, so maybe, you, you know, there could be some messages coming through your dreams but also pay attention to your dreams you know to create them tangible dreams you know your dreams your wishes your desires that stone is there okay and scorpio enchantment okay very important message too okay so this is this is a beautiful card when we're looking at enchantment it's like what sparks what sparks your passions um, looking at things in a different perspective. Um, take nature walks. Do something that you love. Because um, there's something there that may um, bring you some kind of um, message, um, in, inspiration. And that could come through. It comes through seeing things. Like, uh, in, how do I want to say it? See, I'm stumbling here. Enchantment comes through, it's like it, you take a nature walk in that and all of a sudden you just see a bird fly by and then something sparks and it just comes and it, it cre creates even a bigger picture. So that is the message that came through, you guys. Um, Sagittarius. Let me just push these up. I don't have much room here. Guardian Angel. So know that you are protected. Um, if you need help, um, any affirmations, um, if you're feeling lonely, this is sometimes what we see um, when we pull guardian angels. Know that they are around you, okay? Call for them for help if you need so. And Capricorn, patience is required. So any situation, anything that you're going through, it's telling me that patience is required in your situation. So a little bit of patience is what's coming through there Aquarius compassion so everything you do like we saw that stone there too do things with love compassion for yourself with others as well Pisces transition okay so we that's coming up mostly for you guys here this is a transitional time in your life so know that a lot of things um, and processes that you're going through is a transitional point in your life. Aries. Playfulness. Okay. You know that how we always say work hard but play hard too. Okay. So it creates some playfulness. Take time out from whatever worries work and just enjoy. Okay. So playfulness came out for you guys. And Taurus. Protection. Okay, so protection is beautiful. This is usually that you are protected. Um, that could be spiritually, physically. The thing is, sometimes it says protect, protect the things that you have around you as well. Okay, well, this was a quick um, toss of the energies of the day and specific cards for each. And I hope you have a wonderful new moon in Gemini. It is a progressive time. We're seeing that there too. And yeah. Bye for now.